We are rapidly approaching an amazing 10,000 subscribers and once we do, I'll be giving five lucky people the deluxe monthly subscription card. All you've got to do to enter is make sure you are subscribed. Hey guys, Jay Spartan here. Welcome back to my channel and I hope you're all enjoying your Easter weekend because I know that I am. All this chocolate is such a treat guys. I don't eat chocolate very often but Easter eggs are just too irresistible. But anyway, into the video. This video is going to be a guide more aimed at you newer guys that just want to learn how to progress faster through the game. It's going to be full of all my best tips and tricks on how to progress faster. On to the first step now. So my first tip guys is to make sure that you claim your AFK rewards at least once every 12 hours because if you're letting it go over 12 hours it's not being productive and you are missing out on vital resources that can help you progress a lot faster in the game. From AFK rewards you can get a lot of gold and you can also get diamonds sometimes when there's a special event. You can get loads of player XP, loads of hero XP and this really is guys the best way to progress faster as long as you're claiming it at least once every 12 hours it's never getting full so my first tip guys make sure to always claim your afk rewards and just try to do it at least twice a day so that way you're not missing out so my next tip is a bit of a controversial one a few of you guys might disagree with this one um but i honestly think this is better so my, my, my tip is to not waste your diamonds on items until you have a full team of at least legendary heroes. Only buy an item if you are really, really stuck and it's at least legendary rating because buying rare and epic gear really is just a waste of time, guys, and it's a waste of diamonds as well because in a couple of days, you'll find better gear for free from AFK rewards and from beating Riz and Soren. You really don't wanna spend diamonds um, on gear unless you really, really have to and you're really stuck. In my opinion, it's always better to spend diamonds on new heroes because it, it's always the heroes that are going to help you progress further. You can't play this game unless your heroes are levelling up. So this tip, guys, unless you really, really have to, don't waste your diamonds on gear unless it's at least legendary rating and you desperately need it. As we all know, friends are important in real life and on this game. You're allowed to have a maximum of 30 friends and please guys, just make sure your friend list is always full. This way, you know you're gonna be getting at least, well, the maximum of 20 hearts every day. And those 20 hearts can go towards summons. And as we know, the best way to progress is to get new heroes. So take full advantage of the free hearts, guys. Make sure you send and receive your hearts every day. Help your friends and let them help you. So my next and probably most important tip is to make sure you're doing your dailies try and play this game at least once a day guys because if not it really will be hindering at your progress and it will re it really will slow it down so the dailies consist of the labyrinth in the labyrinth you get to do it uh, once every two days and if you can get to the end of stage three you do get a nice reward labyrinth can be quite difficult but i have done a guide on the labyrinth if you guys want to check it out and and, and, and uh, as always guys I do live streams every Sunday. If you're stuck in the labyrinth, you can of course message me in the live stream and I'll give you my best advice whilst the live stream is active. Um, but the labyrinth can be really challenging, but as long as you've got plenty of heroes and you are using the resonating crystal, it does get a lot easier guys. And we do have Jura's tears as well. So doing the labyrinth is one part of the dailies you can do. The next one is to do your bounty quests. Uh, if you go to the bounty quest here on the bounty board, there's so many you can do every day and you can get some really cool rewards as well. I was a bit unfortunate this time because all I'm getting is a bit of gold. Um, but if you go on to the friends summons, just look, 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 look at all these diamonds I can get for free here. And then obviously some uh, rare hero soul stones as well, which are really, really going to be helpful. And of course, we can't forget the hero essence, one of the rarest materials in this game and it is so hard to get. Um, but it is so crucial to helping your progress. So my next one is for the, uh, the next daily, sorry, is the daily quests. Complete your daily quest, guys. It is so vital you do this as you can get 100 diamonds a day and a free summon every single day. And you can also complete your weekly quests and that will give you 400 diamonds for the week and three extra summons as well. 
which means that just for just for playing the game basically you're getting 10 free summons every week and 1100 diamonds every week just for free and just for playing the game and completing really really simple quests and of course we need to fight Riz daily as well and Sovereign whenever you can whenever it's open in your guild Sovereign and Riz give you amazing new gear and I always always fight um, Riz without fault and Sovereign as soon as it's open and this guys brings me on to my next tip so joining a guild in this game is probably the best thing you can do to help not only yourself but other players as well. You can use each other's heroes in the library to complete the unions and you can share really vital tips and ask questions and get some feedback from other guild members. Guild is an amazing place where you can share advice, share tips and as long as you're in a good community guys, being in a guild will really really help you progress and as long as there's somebody in your guild of experience you can always ask some questions and have somebody to rely on which is why i've decided that i'm going to be opening my own guild for subscribers only this will be the spartan army guild if you guys are interested in joining leave a comment down below as i really want to start a guild where we can sort of share tips and advice in the guild ask questions and it will be a great way for you to get for, uh, for you to get to know me as a person um, and i'm really excited to be doing this guys so i'll be starting the guild probably tomorrow if you guys are interested leave a comment letting me know so i know you guys are interested in this thanks for watching guys and if you found this video helpful please do drop a like and guys please do enjoy your easter <laughs> make sure you eat lots of chocolate and i'll see you all in the next video thanks for watching